This Torah class is brought to you by TorahAnytime.com. The Gemara Bracha and Avdaun Mebez asks, Why is there no Nun in Ashrei? Why is there no letter Nun represented in Ashrei? We know Ashrei goes as an acrostic by the letters of the Aleph Bez, and there's no sentence for letter Nun. Says the Gemara, because it predicts the downfall of the, it's a euphemism, the enemy of the Jewish people, but it refers to the Jewish people. But nevertheless, the Gemara says, David came and supported it, Baruch HaKodesh, he said, Even though the Nefila is not even alluded to, David HaMelech supported it anyway. Okay. And the question is, there's no Nun in Ashrei, because David did not want to allude to the downfall of the Son of Yisrael, and he came and he supported it, Baruch HaKodesh, Everything he said was Baruch HaKodesh. Why do we specifically refer to the support of the downfall was supported Baruch HaKodesh? Everything, is, everything that David HaMelech said, everything that David wrote in Tehillim is Baruch HaKodesh. The Bnei Yisachar has an astounding pshat in this, in this uh, Gemara. We mentioned that the month of Cheshvan, Rav Menachem Endel Meriminov writes, he makes an observation that all the decrees... Uh, throughout history, taxes, persecutions, always began in the month of Cheshvan. The reason being, because in this month, Yeravam broke away from the Malchus Beis David. That was the beginning of the crack in the solidification of the Jewish government and the Jewish sovereignty. The Pasuk says in Malachim Beis, Parak Yedzayin, Pasuk Chaf Aleph, Ayas Yeravam es hachag b'choydash hashmini. Yeravam said, we're not going to celebrate Tishrei, we're going to celebrate Cheshvan. Why Cheshvan? It's a month he made up. But Milibay could also be uh, re scrambled to spell bull. Bull referring to the month of Cheshvan, which is the month of bull. We explained yesterday why Cheshvan is referred to as the month of bull. So, it comes out that the month of Cheshvan is the month that created the Nefila of Klal Yisrael. The Sefer Hayatzira in Parakeh writes that the month of Cheshvan was created with the letter Nun. Himlich ois nun bereach. God gave dominion to the letter nun. The letter associated with the month of Cheshvan is the letter nun. Nun represents not only the downfall of Klal Yisrael then, but nun represents the disintegration of Malchus Beis David. It's not only that David HaMelech didn't want to allude to the nephil of Klal Yisrael, but there was something specific to Malchus Beis David which which David did not want to allude to. The letter Nun is not only the Nefilas Yisrael, the letter Nun is the month of Cheshvan. The letter Nun is the month in which Yeravam broke away from Malchus Beis David, and it's the month, as we observed, as, as we learned from the observation of Rav Menachem and Rav all Jewish persecution and decrees and taxes have been incurred in the month of Cheshvan. Then when we say, when the Gemara says that David supported it with the letter Samach, if he didn't want to write a nun because that was a reference to Chodesh Cheshvan, then if he wrote a Samach, the Samach must, be, must refer to the month that alludes to the support of the Malchus Beis David. And we know the Sefer Yitzira writes that the, letter, that the month of Kislev was created with the letter Samach. So David didn't want to allude to Cheshvan, but he did allude to, to Kislev. Kislev is created with the letter Samach. Kislev then is the month of miracles. Because when you have a nun, which is nefila, and you juxtapose the samach, that spells out nes, miracle. The month of Kislev is the month of the inauguration, the Chanukah, of the third Beis HaMikdash. But, as we learned yesterday, God reserved that for the month of Cheshvan. In other words, the Beis HaMikdash will be ultimately uh, nischanech and redeemed in the month of Cheshvan. So it will begin in the month of Kislev, the month of the Samach, the month of the ultimate support. When David HaMelech supported the month of Cheshvan, Baruch HaKodesh, even though everything he said was Baruch HaKodesh, but the root of David's Baruch HaKodesh, the root of his heavenly, holy, divine spirit, comes from the month of Kislev. David HaMelech was Masmechit Baruch HaKodesh, that means his Shoyresh of Baruch HaKodesh emanated from the month of the Samach, the month of his slave. So amazingly, we learn that David did not only want, not only did David refrain from alluding to the letter nun, but he 
refrain from uh, alluding to the month created with the Ois Nun, which is the month of Cheshvan, the month that Yeravam broke away. And we should be Zoycha to see God pay back the month of Cheshvan, whose an, um, permutation of the Yud Kei Vav Kei is Udevash Hayoim Hazah um, Hashem, which we learned that the permutation of the Yud Kei Vav Kei was Udevash Hayoim Hazah Hashem, which is Vav Hey Hey Yud. We should be zoicha to perceive the great honey that is laden in the month of Cheshvan. You've just experienced another Torah class brought to you by TorahAnytime.com.